This video is brought to you by Miniature Market. Thousands of board games, discounted prices, miniaturemarket.com. Starship Samurai is an area control game for two to four players where each of you are going to be drafting two of these really cool samurais at the beginning of the game. Not only do they have power and special abilities, but they also come with their very own matching miniatures that you'll be placing out on the board. During the game, you'll be placing action tokens onto one of four possible actions with a specific amount of power. And over the course of the game, you're trying to control different areas because at the beginning of each turn, if you control one of these, you get the abilities, sometimes points, on the card, which can move these different clans up and down your specific score tracks, getting you a certain amount of points at the end of each round. But at the end of the round, anybody involved in battles will get a chance to play cards. And these do all sorts of different things like just adding power or sneak attacking, but some of them cost certain things in order to play them. The winner won't only get the award, but they'll also get five points for each location they keep. But they must take all their units back, leaving the other player's units there for next round. And you're also trying to collect ones that have different numbers for different set collection for points at the end of the game. Hello my friends, it's the Game Boy Geek here. Starship Samurai has simple turns, but oh my, tough decisions on every single turn. You can't do everything you want to do, so it feels a little tight, but I like that aspect of it. It's essentially area control with set collection, and you're also drafting samurais. You're moving up these different clan tracks to get different points over the different rounds, which will influence what you're trying to control. And the battle cards that you play are simultaneously revealed. Very interesting thing there in those card plays. Also, the winner's units have to come back, which helps other people get into those and helps balance things out and you get rewards if you control things each turn. Overall, I love this game. It is a fantastic area control game, very streamlined. Few negatives, the player aid could have some scoring info on it. Uh, the bigger unit, uh, the bigger problem is the units themselves could really use some color bases. It's really hard to remember who Samurai is who, what their power values are, and they just come in a bag, which could be a little bit easily damaged, but the price point is low for what this game is. And the game is definitely longer than advertised, but it's amazing. Great streamlined area control game and a got a saxophone serenade. This video was sponsored by Miniature Market's Review Corner. The Review Corner features podcasts, video, and written game reviews by gamers for gamers. Miniature Market, the online gaming superstore. Thousands of board games, discounted prices. Check them out at miniaturemarket.com.